A state lawmaker wants to end offshore oil drilling in California waters forever. That means ending all current leases and drilling operations. KCON 9 political reporter Tom Wade is here now with details on that proposed bill. Tom? Hi, Jeff. Well, the state senator behind the bill says last October's horrific oil spill off the coast of Orange County is just one example of why a ban needs to be put in place. But leaders in the petroleum industry say the ban does not make sense economically or environmentally. Enough is enough. Orange I mean, County State Senator Dave Min says it's time to ban oil drilling off California's coast permanently. He says the massive oil spill that happened last fall off Orange County's coast sums up why the drilling must stop. As I learn more about what was going on with these offshore oil rigs, uh, the more determined I, I became to, to end it. The proposed ban, first reported by the LA Times, would end offshore oil production starting in 2024. Currently, Min's office says there are 11 leases and three active oil rigs in California's waters. Senator Min says the drilling benefits versus the cost to the environment is not worth the risk. These oil rigs, these leases, have been around for decades, since the 1970s, 1960s, 1970s. And at this point, all the major oil corporations have abandoned it. They've given it over to these thinly capitalized wildcat companies uh, that have no invest, no, no incentives to invest in the infrastructure. Uh, we're going to face a lot more of these types of oil spills. You know, any ban or mandate like this uh, just means that we will need to import more energy from foreign sources. Kevin Slagle is with Western States Petroleum Association. They represent one of the companies with offshore drilling operations. This bill is concerning because it sets up a uh, potential for a big takings claim by eliminating existing leases and existing equipment. So they're right. WISPA, the Western State Petroleum Association, is right in that we would have to provide just compensation. Uh, I think that amount of money is not going to be as significant as they're making it out to be. And here's why. Uh, the amount of oil revenue left in these in these leases is not that much. Representing the oil workers, State Building and Constructions Trades Council released this statement. There's a constant drumbeat to cease oil and gas production in California with no corresponding responsible plan to power our state. Should we really be tanking more oil into California, greatly increasing carbon emissions as hundreds of tankers idle in our ports waiting to offload? Those are families who live and work in the area who have good paying jobs and good careers that will be eliminated by these types of uh, bans and mandates. Senator Min says his goal is to find other jobs for those who would be impacted. He says there are only three platforms that would be affected by this legislation, and the bill would only control three nautical miles off the coast because, remember, beyond that, the federal government is in charge. Jeff, back to you.